2K, uh, that's a 2K10. Cause I don't really, that's the best one oh, okay. I play. I don't really like the other one. So, so you like the older consoles more than? No, nah, no, nah, I got the PS4, but I play 2K10 oh. because I just, I like playing it because how it is. How you doing? I'm here, for, I'm here for the interview. You for the interview? Yeah. Alright, if you can take a seat over there, I'll be with you momentarily. Okay. Y'all doing, y'all still, I'm a little late. Y'all still you doing? Like, uh, yeah, you, you, a few minutes late. It's okay though, it's okay. You know okay. what I mean? Usually it's, uh, it's mandatory that uh, most interviewers come in on time, so. Yeah, I know, yeah. Just it's just Atlanta traffic, you know. Okay. Thank you. Okay. 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 All right, how's How it going? How My name is Paul. How you doing? All right. So, um, what's your name? Gerard. Gerard uh, Henderson. Gerard, uh, I have Jamal Henderson on my Jamal, yeah, Gerard. Yeah, on the application. Yeah, I don't know if, it's, it's, if, if that's an alias name or. No, 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 that's right. That's right. I just thought you said that's my nickname. Okay. Um, yeah. So, you have any, um, do you have any work experience for fast food? Yeah. If, if, if what? Yeah, we, uh, I used to work at Papa's. I worked at uh, Papa's. Uh, let's see. I worked at McDonald's before a while ago, but oh. yeah, this was like because I just moved to Atlanta. So yeah, so yeah, I worked it. I mean, any, you know, um, any years of experience or food mm. trainer, grill. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I mean, I used to. Uh, I used to be in the back. I used. To, I used to drop the fries and stuff. Oh, oh, like oh, as you, oh, like back the, food, they say orders, but. The fry station is in the front of the. Oh, okay. 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 Um. Why? What was your reason for leaving the recent <coughs> job that you left to become uh to come here for a better opportunity? I mean. I mean, just better opportunities. That's what I said. I really want to work for McDonald's because I know I feel like I'm like I'm really good at dropping fries. I'm really good at like you know making the burgers like it was a set time record that they had at ours because we had a chart at our lo old location we had a chart where we used to be like who dropped the fries on time who get there who who do this who do that and just different type of things that be leading up to the you know situation when they take time if you think about it like i said at the end of the day it's about it's a mindset thing right right it's when it comes to mcdonald's like exactly. it's it's a mindset thing when right, you come to mcdonald's right. because people want to do it for fast money but this is actually a career somewhere where you can see yourself going right. long Jeez, term exactly yeah, yeah. It's, a, it's a big opportunity it's a big field right too, man. um why should we hire you i mean is there a specific reason in detail mm -hmm. why we should we hire i couldn't say i had open interviews today and you know i mean with me i'm different because i i be real right i'm okay. open okay 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 so and when it comes to me, I do what I gotta do. When it comes to everything, like if you, you, you know, yeah, when it comes to different customers, when the customers say they need it, like at the end of the day, they, customers be wrong sometimes, but you gotta let them know, hey, this ain't the place, we ain't going for that. Yeah, exactly. If you exactly. want it, you can go, what's over there, you can go across the street with all that. Yeah, Cause I'm yeah, real, for sure, for sure, I'm, for I'm gonna sure. be real with mine, yeah, you know, cause yeah. that's, that's what it's about. And yeah. like I said, it's just like, I've got opportunity. I used to be, I used to be, in the army and like I said and right now I really don't need a job like it's just my I know my personal skills are really good that would be a exactly. great fit yeah. for the situation uh you know uh, right. how's it uh, going? Uh, I have a couple more questions man um what motivates you I mean any mm -hmm. uh well any people or just things? just jewelry okay. little baby little baby motivate me I listen a little who else motivate me I really uh Drake uh, I really like Drake, uh, Mozzie. Yeah. Can you speak in like a like work ethic term if you can? Yeah, they be working. They be working. Yeah, uh, I I don't know if Drake or Lil Baby made a double cheese or a Big Mac. Or I, 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 yeah. But but the, I, 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 uh, that could be included <coughs> in the actual interview. I could use that as a advantage for you to obtain a job here at our McDonald's. Um, mm. is that if I get something? Is that if I get something to drink? Uh, Cause usually when I usually do interviews, uh -huh. they used to ask you for something to drink. You didn't, so I don't know. Yeah. Uh, Any reason why you didn't ask me for something to drink? Um. Not a not a specific reason. So do you feel like y'all hired me? Y'all need help right now? Yeah, man, we need help. Uh, what's your availability? I mean, what y'all got open? Uh, right now we have 
we have a morning shift open right now. Yeah, that's overnight. too early. That's too it's early. Too I really, I like night shift because if early, look, I'm saying when it comes in the morning, I'm gonna keep it real. I'll be doing stuff in the morning. I ain't got time to be coming in here like in the morning. At night is really my time. I'll come in. Y'all got night shift? Yeah, yeah uh, we have a night shift. Well, y'all open 24 hours? We have to open 24 hours. Yeah, so if y'all did something overnight, and then, like I said, every 20, I like it, it, It'd be like from a 10, uh, 10 p.m. to 6 a.m. No, nah, 10 yeah. too early. I need 10, like 11 p.m. 11, 10, 11. 10 too early in a day. day from yeah, yeah. No, nah, I'm just saying, am I making you nervous or something? Uh, uh, not, not really, man. Um, See, that's what I'm saying. You stuttering and I, stuff. I really, uh... I don't mind you asking me 21 questions, uh, you know. No, because I'm just trying to make this sure this job is a good yeah, fit for yeah, me. Yeah. And, and, you trying to make sure I'm a good fit for it, but I got to make sure what's good for me. Exactly. $8? That's too low. That's too low? Mm -mm. What? Uh, no, that's what I'm saying. I can bring on my resume because I put, I didn't, I could add some more stuff for there. That's too low, though. Oh. I need about at least, like, I say, like, because, like, right now, stuff is high. Stuff is I high, tell yeah. I people motivate me. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So I need, need like a good 25, yeah. 25. 20, 25. I'm not even making that, sir, so I I couldn't possibly even uh, uh, request that to my supervisors for you to make that pay in hours. So, so I understand, I understand. Any, I can take yeah. whatever you can get, though. Yeah. You mind pulling your mask up because uh, of Corona stuff for me? Oh, uh, yeah. Um, uh, did you come with a mask today? I don't know. If, I mean, no, nah, I don't. Come. I didn't come with one. Uh, uh, I didn't yeah. come with one. Yeah, screens. We had these types of screens. Uh, hold on, hold on. So, Oh, okay. All right. One yeah. second. No problem, sir. I mean, hold on. Okay. <clears throat> hold on. Okay. No problem. <clears throat> my brother, real quick. Notify me when you when you're ready. Yeah, hold on real quick. <coughs> Did I do drug test? Uh, uh, hold on real quick. Hey, bro. What's going on? I'm up here at McDonald's right now. Hold on. We got they having interviews right here. I'm, uh, they get they hiring right now. I'm up here right now. Yeah, I'm up at McDonald's. Like, they hiring right now. I'm in an interview right now. The fuck is wrong with you? What you at McDonald's for, sir? No, I'm getting an interview right now. I'll let you know. They hiring right now. How many people y'all looking for? Uh, we need at least, like, uh, we need three people, man. Like, ASAP. If, huh? If you, if you can. I'm not working at no fucking McDonald's. Yeah, I'm right here. Look, yeah, I'm just saying. They were hiring right now. I don't give a fuck. I'm not working at no McDonald's, huh? Come on, you doing too much, bro. Let me see what you got on, sir. Uh, pull on, on the shorts. Hey, don't hire his stupid ass. Come on. That's my brother. Yeah. yeah. How long does this interview last? I'm good. Yeah, I'm just ready to go. I'm just saying, you call me, let me know if I get it or not. Be honest with you. I really, because me, like I said, you hire me, you hire me. You I don't, you don't. I don't, yeah, yeah. Like I said, you yeah. already hired five people. Yeah. I'm just trying to understand if you got two or three spots, like why hire, yeah. why are you interviewing five people? Exactly. But at the same time, there's certain specific uh, answer that we need from. Uh, well, yeah, playing with people though. That's what I'm saying. That's why I really don't feel like it's comfortable if you think about it. You, you need, it's two spots open. And then it's like, imagine you, it's two spots open and you, you tell them five people, 10 people come. And then them ten people come, and it's only two. That ain't right. Right. And as uh, you, you as a manager, with your Paul, you uh, look, you look like a jerk. And then, uh, like I said, it's not your fault. You doing what they telling you to do, but yeah, you gotta let them know it ain't good. Yeah, yeah. And I'm not disrespectful. Like I said, yeah. I need this. I need the money. But like I said, I'm not here. I'm not here to pity pack. You feel uh, me? Yeah, I'm gonna keep yeah. it real with you all the yeah. way. You're honest, you're honest, you're honest. Cause some people be like, oh yeah, I'll be on time. Cause like if you think about it, some people be like, oh, what's your transportation? Like. Obviously, I ain't got a whip right now. That's why I'm late. So I'm running late because I, I need a job to get a car. Right now, I, I'm going through stuff. And I can hear your fries back there. Are y'all late on fries? Y'all need help. Yeah, yeah. So, you know what? I There's a possibility that I can really get you uh, started for orientation tomorrow morning at 10 a.m. sharp if you can come. I'm good. It's too soon. It's too soon? Yeah. All right. Is there any other, oppor uh, other opportunities you were looking forward to? If, you, if I'm a good fit. Like I said, I know you gotta review the applications and yes. you tell me you're hiring me. Yes, sir. But yes, sir. I know you ain't gonna hire me because y'all gotta review it, right? You got five other people. Yeah, I have yeah, five. Yeah, but you other look, people. but I'm saying this, I'm gonna cut you ain't got a lot of me. And you, I know you ain't gotta call me back, but I'm around the corner. 
And like I said, you don't call me back, it can be it be problems, and not just with you, but just McDonald's. Yeah. No issue with you, because you're just doing your job, and you got to go through other people yeah, to hire me, right? Yeah, exactly. Y'all got to yeah, review yeah. applications, exactly. right? Exactly, yeah. I'm but you said I can people. start the, tomorrow. You can start tomorrow, so. But you're just saying that, though, So the, and you're not going to call me back, because I understand, because I'm real. Right. But like I said, I'm going to go ahead, I'm going to leave this interview. You sit here, I'm good, I'm going to go ahead and leave. Do it look like I need this job? Uh... I don't know. I mean, you came here interested, looking for opportunity. I mean, you know, I don't know if you want to, you know. I ain't worried about it. And then, like I said, y'all lobby empty. And like I said, y'all just got people over here. He ain't even got his food yet. Uh, yeah. He ain't even got his food. You could have hired me. I could have been did this thing. But like I yeah. said, you wasting my time and your time, partner. Yeah. Like I said, all you have to say is, like I said, I fill out the application. Let me know. And... I'm good though. Call y'all. Yeah, call me back yeah. if y'all call me back. But I ain't worried about it. Excuse me. Can I still get that cup? Oh yes sir. Yes sir. Yes sir. Thank you. No problem. Yeah, cup. Any uh any drinks on your uh specific? Uh, I just get. You can hook me up. Give me the mimic mate. Mimic mate. Mimic mate. Any ice? Yeah. Give me the mimic mate. Uh, oh, oh, excuse me. You, you can't. Uh, you can't come around. It's 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 like a. It's, it's a cross contamination thing. You huh? also don't have a mask. You so said I cross can't. cross pan patient. Cr cross 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 contamination. Ah, okay. That's yeah. all you have to say. I didn't know it should have yeah. put a sticker on here said on cross patient. Yeah. I thought this was like little part of the playground shit it, that it, we having. It's it's. I mean, it's obvious that this is is shield, so no customers could come to this area, and it's only for. Uh, yeah, I thought this was the playground shit y'all be having and shit for the kids. I ain't, I, I, I get I still behind it. I ain't yeah, really, yeah, yeah, yeah. No yeah. problem. It, 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 Mind, yeah, yeah, I'm just saying I don't want to be talking but like I'm this give me jail vibes yeah. I used to talk behind it behind it. I don't like talking behind glasses. I don't do that um, You know, I'm good on that cup too cuz I guess yeah, I'm good cuz I'm just saying you telling me get behind the glass That's 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 not cool. You as yeah. a man I'm just trying to, uh, Yeah, I ain't worried about it. I ain't worried about it Yeah, they wildin bro. I was like I said, I'm not about it. I don't need a job I'm My uber at how you doing? I'm doing well. How you doing, James? Fine. I had seen that y'all was hiring. That's why I filled out the application. Yeah, we are. And then that's what uh, I used to, I do, I'm familiar with cars and stuff like mm -hmm. that. So, so what can you do? Uh, you know, do basic stuff like oil changes? Yeah, I know how to do oil changes and I know how to, uh, what's the other stuff called, like radios. I done took some radios out before and stuff like that, but that was back in the day yeah. when I used to make bad decisions with my friends. Did you not take them out, but you not put them back? No, nah, because I used to take them out the car. And like I said, I was young. I was like 15, 16. Mm -hmm. We used to break in cars and we used to take them out. Mm -hmm. So like I said, I'm a changed man now. Right, you know, so right. but like I said, those are bad decisions. Mm -hmm. But me, I decided to like, you know, I want to become a man and get a job. And, I just know you're hiring, so if y'all need help, I'm here. If you need help, why would you skip over me, you know? Mm -hmm. I got you, I got you. Mm -hmm. So what else can you do besides second radios? Uh, oil changes. I did the oil changes before. Mm -hmm. Tire rotations. Just, uh, just I'm, I'm really good with a lot of stuff. I liked a lot of stuff with my daddy before he left. My daddy left me when I was, what, 17? Mm -hmm. He taught me a lot about cars, you know? All right. All right, so you know how to change rims and everything? Mm -hmm. yeah, 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 yeah. Easy stuff, right? Mm-hmm. What about uh, tune-ups and stuff like that? You said to turn it up? Tune-ups. Oh, I was going to say turn up. I was about to say because I used to turn up, but I don't do it. I don't know how to do tone ups You don't know how to do none of that? No. But you don't, you're not working on cars, though, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, and that's where you can teach me at. If y'all didn't know how to do that mm -hmm. and y'all got somebody here, why can't y'all just teach me that? You know? I got you. I got you. Mm -hmm. So you're on like an apprenticeship kind of deal. A what? Apprenticeship, like uh, like fixing cars and uh, learn as you go. Yeah, that, that's cool. Kind of. Mm -hmm. Like fix cars at all? Uh, yeah, yeah. I didn't fix a couple cars no. before. I worked at Popeyes, mm -hmm. and Popeyes is kind of familiar with fixing cars. If you think about no. it, it's about getting it done mm -hmm. in a fast pace mm -hmm. and rushing it out. Rushing it out? Yeah, rushing it out. Oh, okay, rushing it out. Gotcha. Yeah, and you, cause you don't want to sit the car in there too long. Nah, you don't want to do that. So if you think about it, if we're switching grease. It's just like switching oil because it got to be clean and you got to get it done quick and fast because right. it's hot. Right. It's a mindset thing. I got you. Yeah. I got you. It's like a mindset thing that you got to do, you know? Mm -hmm. And that's why I say it's just a good fit. I really need a job. I just got out of jail mm -hmm. and my baby mama on me, they on me about child support, get this and get that. So like I said, not only that, I'm going to do what I got to do to keep the job because the situations I'm in. You have your own tools? 
uh, like a stick. No, no, like ranches and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah I got a pipe on me. I keep it. You know, you know what I'm saying? If you talk, like tools for the streets. What, what kind of pipe? I really don't want to talk about right, right now. I gotcha, I gotcha. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, okay. How much do y'all start off? How, how much? Uh, yeah. $10 an hour. That's cool. That's mm -hmm. cool. That's not really bad. And then mm -hmm. that's what I said. You put in 40 hours a week. And then 40 times 10, you make good by like $1,000 a week. That's that's cool. That's good for me right. and my budget. You know? Closer to like 400 a week, right? Huh? Closer to like 800 a week, right? That's cool. I mean, that's kind of a little bit too low because I got kids. I got, got five kids. kids. You got five kids? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So that's what I'm saying. I mean, how long you been here? I've been here 10 years. Ten yeah, years. that's a long time. So mm -hmm. you want, you like seeing new faces, new mm -hmm. people around. Right, right. Yeah. But that's a lot of kids, right? Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. But like I said, other than that, I mean, I'm a busy man. Like I said, I, I, a lot of people calling me for jobs. I got you. So a lot of people want me. So like I said, for me to come in your environment mm -hmm. and you hire me, it'd be a blessing. Y'all got nice rims over there. What size are those rims over there? Those are 20 floors. Them are nice right there. That's what I say. That, like, that'll be good on like a Chevy or something like that with some beat. Right, right. Play like some. Mozzie, Cedric Hendrick, like, you know, it'll look, it'll look good on some, uh, a lot, you know, a lot of people's stuff, you really think about it. But other than that, it's just a, a whole thing about the cars. When, you, when it comes to cars, it's really your heart thing. Because you treat the car like your heart, right. you know? And like I said, it's, because uh, the last car, I had, the, I had a Mustang and I put 10 W50 in it. One time, and I wasn't thinking with my heart, and I messed up the transmission. Right. Right. So, I mean, it's just all about a learning thing. So, I'm willing to come in your shop and change a lot and learn and grow and grow. Right. You didn't use canola oil or anything like that on the bus Co Corona? Corona. Uh, ca canola. Canola oil. Uh, no, 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 never, 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 never. Hold on real fast. Just checking out my Instagram stuff, seeing my Instagram. A lot of people be hitting me up on there. I told you I'm a busy person, you know? I'm just like, no disrespect or nothing like that. It's just I gotta make sure I ain't gonna hold you up. Long day? Y'all busy today? Very busy, James. Very busy. Yeah. Yo, what's going on with you? Shit. I'm trying to go to the barbershop, what's up with you? And then I'll be here with this interview right now. I'm getting an interview right now. <clears throat> oh, okay. What, what are you about to get a job in now? Uh, what you mean now? This like uh, you, you said where I'm about to get a job now? Yeah. This little car shop. They want me. He right here. He interviewed me right now. I just called him because you said call you. I was just seeing what you up to real quick. Uh, that's what's up. Uh, you going to be cleaning rooms? Yeah. Hey, Brittany, Brittany hit you back last night? Nah. All right. Okay. Well, let me come back when I get through with this interview. You need a job? You need somewhere? I mean, yeah. If they paying good. Y'all paying good? Yeah. My boy looking for one. You need what you what you trying to start off with? Man, I need at least seventeen. That's a lot, man. Huh? That's a lot. So we start off ten here, buddy. Ten. That been cool like twenty years ago. We can't live up to it. That's what I'm trying to tell him. Unless, you know, like I said, I don't know, unless y'all go, do y'all go up, do y'all do get commission off selling right, rims? Right, right, you do. You do? Mm -hmm. All right, well, they do that commission stuff and all that other crap. And they probably don't pay that much commission if they only paying 10 an hour. Right, that's true, so is it? Well, you get 10 plus commission. Hmm. How, how are you supposed to live off 10 hours now? How are you supposed, to, how are you supposed to live off 10 hours? You gotta make waste, man. You gotta make do. Mm-hmm. Can we live here at the shop while we working? Can, can, can we live here at the shop? No, no. Huh? No. What you say? You can't live here at the shop. Huh? You can't live here, buddy. Uh, he said no. Nah. You can't even afford none of them wheels making $10 an hour. Yeah. I mean, but it's cool. It's a mindset thing. But let me hit you right back when I get through with this interview because I see he, he getting a little bit impatient. All right, bro. All right, be safe. Hey, uh, when you, uh, Call, call him after you uh, hit, hit old girl up. Did she get that booster? She get them close? All right, I'm gonna call you back. Yeah. All right, James. It's good meeting you, James. It's over? Yeah, I think it's over for James. Why? I don't think you'd be a good fit here, man. Why? 
just uh, not the right type. Right type what? What, just, clothes? Nah, to work here. Just not the I gotta right. change my outfit? Nah, you good, you good. Just not the right type, man. I'm trying to see what right type, what you like? Yeah, what I got you, girls, you want to think, somebody think? You gotta work think? on cars, you know, you gotta be patient. I, I am patient. You can't be rude. You know? I'm not rude. You're not rude, I know, but you just can't. You just... But what type, you saying you need like some dick or something? And it... <laughs> no, 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 no. So I just filled out the application for nothing. No, you didn't fill it out. You fill and it I out so we can here. have this meeting. And then I came up here for nothing. No, you didn't come here for nothing. It's a good thing. Do you do a part two? Can you, like, because you can't go off, listen, can't go off first impressions. Right, right. You got to break somebody back. Right, right. You got to come back and interview me again, sit on it, think on it, sleep on it. You didn't even sleep on it. Right. You tell me I ain't a good fit. I just don't think you're a good fit. Why? It's just it's not going to work out. It's a mindset thing. I understand. It's just not going to work out. So what am I supposed to do from here? Because I got dropped off. Yeah, drop off, you know, you can always walk the buses right there. I don't do no buses. I don't, don't do, do no buses. Uh -uh. I ain't doing that. You can always walk. Nah, I mean, or y'all got a whip, pocket bro. A what? A car I can see to leave. No, no, I don't have any. Mm. It's awkward now. Very awkward. I think this meeting's over. So was it a meeting or an interview? Uh, it's an interview, but uh, it's over. It's because I got on the phone. That's what it was. But I had to take that call. Like, you, it's going to be times you got to take calls. I understand. You can't judge me off I that. I understand. I'm not judging. I'm not even trying to get it. I got child support, rent, and I just, listen, I need it. I understand. I take, I take $6 an hour if I got to. I understand. I, just, I don't just think it's Do you bad. understand? No, I, you do, I do. You don't know, I Because if you understand, you, you would try to work with me. You're not trying to work with me. You just say I'm not a good fit. Mm -hmm. I don't think it will, will work out, man. Because I'm just saying it's a lot of cars out there. It look like y'all need my help. We do need help, but uh, I don't know if you can work on cars, though. Can you? Let, let's see. Yeah. You ain't even gave me a try. You got your, like I said, you got your own tools? Well, I told I got a pipe on me, that's it, and that's why I'm trying to get rid of that. I ain't, it's not the lifestyle I'm trying to live. I understand, but that's not the tools we need. Yeah. Right, right, right. Uh -huh. So I'm going to call my Uber. I'm just going to get up out of here then. All right. Like I say, if you do need me, my application right there, too. That and I'm just, I'm just around the corner. I got you. Y'all going to, y'all got, uh, you got some food or something? Some food? I don't, I don't have any. KFC's right there, brother. I'm saying, like, you didn't offer me no drink. What do I'm I thirsty. Like? What do I look like? Do, a I, man that's working with money. I just got no, no food for you, man. I'm gonna leave. Like, yeah, that's what say it. Y'all need to work on y'all environment then. I'm gonna like, go. See, look, and I see he y'all dropping off keys. Y'all busy, and I ain't worried about it. Like I said, at the end of the day, I got money. I ain't broke. That's good. That's good. I just need this job to kill time. I'm gonna go ahead and get up out of here then. Alrighty. Yeah. We're gonna leave. <clears throat> nice meeting you. Me too. Cool. What you mean with <laughs> this man just asked you, yo, can I get some free food? You think you wanna hire somebody like that? What are you talking about? He's a dog. <laughs> yeah. Step on the scene, put the coat, coat, magazine, step on the magazine, clip, 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 clip. Uh, wax on. Keep right here. Huh? I probably. What do you want to say? No, it's cool. Right here, right here. I don't really. Uh, let me see. This is kind of Mr. Mm hmm. Oh, that's good. Yeah. <sighs> How y'all doing? All right. All right. Yeah. And what's your name again? Mike. Mike. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so um, he actually applied on Indeed for the assistant manager position. Mm -hmm. um, we have a few different locations. We mm -hmm. have a uh, new one coming on 14th Street, and then we have this one over here, so we'll need somebody to assist me with different projects or whatever. Right, right, right. Um, right. So just kind of give me the background of what you've done before. Yeah, I didn't uh, work at Popeyes. I was assistant manager at Popeyes, KFC. Uh, there's a lot of other restaurants that y'all can name, popular uh, chef. I was a chef at, uh, what's that called? It's it's a restaurant, because I'm from Louisiana. Okay. okay. So it was, what is in, uh, what was that? Turkey Burgers. Who? Huh? Turkey Burgers. That's the name of, of? Yeah, they, they, the yeah, uh-huh, yeah. I was a chef up there. Okay. Yeah, 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 yep, yep. All right, and so okay. how much back experience do you have in management? Uh, management, I mean, I be managing a lot of stuff when it comes to my household. 
and no restaurant. Okay, restaurant. I say just really uh, it's just a mindset thing. But no, what I'm saying is what she's saying is like how like when the person asks you like how much experience you have. Like, right, 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 right. Like. I mean, oh, yeah, yeah, how, how yeah, yeah, you gotta start you? somewhere though, so yeah. it can be here. This is the first time. Okay. I gotta start somewhere, right? Okay, okay. right. I, I understand that, but we're we're really actually looking for a person that already has. The I mean, yeah, I do. I do when it comes to my to yeah. assist the manager and the person that's running. The right, restaurant right, and I manage a lot of stuff when it comes to my kids, my wife, my house. And I, like I manage, you know, I keep up with a lot of stuff. My car, I manage. I'm good at that. I, I, I manage my money. I get. And I, it, I, I understand that right there. But right. You know, it's kind of those are kind of two different things when it comes with a place of business and a restaurant that you're dealing with. You know, because right. we all have kids, we all have money, we all have. To yeah, but I'm on. I'm on child that. support. I, I understand that. That's kind of personal. Like that ain't you know your child support or whatever the case may be. As far as what we're looking and what we're expecting mm -hmm. from you. Right, 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 right. Is are you eligible to run? Right, right, yeah, yeah. I am, I am, I'm, yeah, I'm eligible. Hey, I'm eligible. Yeah, I'm everything, el when I'm when eligible. Not around, when the owner's not around, you understand what I'm saying? And right, right. If one of the service need um, mm -hmm. assistance on the line, exactly. are you eligible to keep up with the assistance that's needed? Are you are you eligible to go get the liquors or certain um, drinks that we make right, right, right. you, you know what i'm saying and, and only way you can tell is when you let me do it and then find out right i i understand that but at the end of the day though we are looking the word once again and there's never no disrespect oh yeah yeah and i ain't taking it's, it like that keyword is experience meaning you already have done this in other places that you worked at but you got to start somewhere though yes I, no, yeah, yeah I that's get, what i'm I just trying that. to say nah, and, and i'm never against mm. that mm -hmm. I'm, I'm a firm believer in giving a person a shot and what's your name again my name is kai how old are you? I'm 43. Okay, and when did you start? Like, if you, your background, like, when was, when did you start? What, your experience? What did my experience? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm the owner of the restaurant. I'm one right. of the owners. Right, right. That's what I'm saying. So, what, what, before you got this position, what did you do? I owned other clothing stores, other businesses. All right. But, yeah, that's what I'm saying. You got to start somewhere. And that's, that's what I'm saying. I, I, I understand that. You have to start somewhere. But I didn't, the difference is, see, because making a conversation about me, but I'm going to just wrap it up a little bit. It's not about where I started. I started right, right, as right. an owner. Can you pull your mask up a little bit for me? Can I pull my mask up? Yeah, just the corona, you know, this corona stuff. But you have your mask down too? Yeah, I just halfway a little bit. I ain't going, you know. I got you. Yeah. But at the end of the day, I understand what you're saying. So I'm just trying to, me and my partner, we're trying to get a feel of how much experience you have. So we know what position, what place that we can mm -hmm. deal with a person. Exactly. That's exactly. And that's why I said just where I come from. You know where I come from? It just be a lot of just a lot of bougie stuff going on, where people just come and then they want to come in and out of your life, and they don't really care about you as a person. So okay. I just I just feel like an environment that I care about me. No, yeah, yeah you want to you want to you want to place work, like, yeah, that I care about me that's and be right. like, yeah, we that's raise right. you, you that's know. A fact. And right. I, that's I agree, and that's what we're about. We're more of a family here. That's uh, a fact. So if we're a family, then that's why y'all get people chances. Yeah, but it's not it's not just about it's not just about everybody that walks through your door, everybody that applies for a position always just get a chance. You right, right, yeah, because then that's it'll like be a, your place to be a building. That's right. And you that's never know who you're letting in. There you go. So there I understand go. that's where my knowledge comes from, and it's a mindset thing where you let a man come up and be a man, you know? Yeah. Because that's what I said. I'm just, I'm just all over the place, and I'm trying to get there, you know? And that's what I'm trying to... So we also have other positions. Yeah. Right, right, right. No, no, I don't want nothing else. No, because it's just, just, I know what I can do. I know what I can bring to the table. So I don't really want nothing else. Okay. What, what I'm saying is, so here we believe in growth and training you to become a mm -hmm. So if me and my partner decide that, you know, maybe you don't have enough experience. And that's that, it, right. Then maybe we can put you in another position and give you the training. Maybe you can shadow me. And you can shadow other people that are in mm -hmm. the establishment. To, to come, come right to, to work your way up because yeah. you got to work your way up the same exact way how you saying yeah. you got to give a person a chance right right right, right 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 but so, yeah it, it's i mean i i wouldn't waste your time i know I what you. i want to do and, I, and, I, I and I, i'm I i'm that. deeper than just mopping floors and cleaning up oh no 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 we're not we're not we're not saying nothing it just that. sound like that's y'all want to do to me no no we're not see you're taking it how you want to take it but at the end of the day you can't 
you can't dictate a bitch. You can say what you what you want. What, and can you break down what dictate means? Because that's a big word. Dictate meaning what we're trying to put you in, what we're trying to place you in. We're not trying right. to place you in anything. We never said nobody said nothing about a mob or and you you assumed that just now. She right. said there could be other positions for you. It's mm -hmm. not about just Oh, we're gonna make you because we have a person that does that already. Right, right, right. So we, right. Don't, we don't need nobody for mm -hmm. that. I just didn't know if that's because you gotta start at the lower place, it's and then you never know. About, but it's not always about start at a lower place. It's not always about start at a lower place. You can start behind the person and watch how they're doing their management skills. And now mm -hmm. when they're when they're not here certain days, you can fill in right. for them. But they can just be around to assist you. During all these days, mm -hmm. so now you you really getting a okay. Cool, and that's what I got. I got. Can I see your phone to call my baby mama? Cause she got my resume. If I can get it. Yeah, but you don't need you don't need the resume of that right now. We nah, don't know I what just, you're saying. We yeah, know. I know. I just it's other stuff that I forgot about that my baby mama. Can I just see your phone? But that's not that's uh, irrelevant. That ain't. Yeah, yeah. Nah, that ain't, that's, that's why I'm trying to show y'all now, cause y'all gonna the first impression is everything. That's a fact. Mm -hmm. And it's just like. The vibe is off. Like how you talking to me is off, and you calm, but it's just I, the vibe is off right now. You saying the vibe? How, the how vibe. The, to yeah, the talk? vibe is just off right now. I'm, I'm, I'm being. If you feeling like that, I'm apologize as a man. No, no, it's okay. No, 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 no it ain't no, no, apologize. No, no, it's just listen, off. Listen, listen, because I don't never want you to come into a place where you feel like anybody that's working for that establishment is making you feel uncomfortable and it ain't true or, yeah it's or, probably it's probably something i didn't say it too it, it yeah, takes two people i'm only i'm only i'm only feeding back what you're giving me. right right so right, I'm right. Just correcting because you're saying how much do y'all even make an hour at this place see how you talking like you don't think that's kind of a little off a little bit right there or like, uh, what's um, the minimum wage is that a better way to say it yeah i mean you know okay, okay. how you put how you okay put okay what's the minimum wage here i'm allowed to tell you tell her so it just depends on the actual position. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. An assistant manager will bring them on at 45. For the yeah, I could do some. Yeah, that's that's a little money, but I can do something with it, you know? Everything matter, you know? Because like I said, it's, you know it's a little wiggy around here. And at the end of the day, like we said, we embrace everybody that works here. Can you break down embrace? I don't know what, what embrace. I'm embrace just saying. Embrace meaning take you in as, as family. As okay, right, right, right. Okay, you just Not say, as yeah, a, yeah, that's what I'm saying. You're using like really big words. You could just like I'll take you as a family. It's just throwing my knowledge off. I ain't really that smart. I ain't I up the street you, part. I, I re listen, I respect everything. And that's why saying. I say when you break it down, I can take that no and I'm doubt. using it. I'm no learning doubt. stuff as we go. No doubt. You know, you feel me? No and that's why I say, as, as you as a black queen, you as a black king, no y'all just gotta fill me in. I got you. I respect you. It's no right or wrong once you get in. And like I said, all, and if it ain't a good fit, guess what? Go on, go on about no your doubt. business. I respect that. I respect that. So like I said, then I could start tomorrow. I got you. Usually how the process goes, we'll usually interview you. Yeah, and that's how they usually do it. It takes a long time, and then you got to no, do the background. Take long. It don't even, it's not a, not now, even, it don't take you long. And, and background yeah. will be something that is important just because you'll be dealing with Y'all hire felons and stuff like that? Yeah, we ain't just. Okay, yeah, because that's what I said. I, I broke in a car, a few cars a couple times, and then that, they pinned that on me. You know you. what I'm saying? It's deeper than that. It's, it's a you. mindset thing. I got you. It's a mindset thing. And that's why I said I don't fart around. You know, I'm about I'm about being real. I let y'all know what I can do and what I can't do. And, I, and, I and that's just what that. it is. Because you have a lot of people that come into here and apply do that. and they right. can't do certain things. But then now when you get put under the gun, it's like, oh, I don't know how to do that. Uh huh. And how long is open? What's your well, how long is this open? Like, like the time? Like, yeah, like yeah. From the, what time? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like from 12 to like sometimes 2. It'll depend on how that date is. You know, okay, um, okay, 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 okay. So and what, 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 what's the shifts? Like, what's that oh, y'all got available? So with the assistant manager, you're mm -hmm. filling in behind me. Okay. I'm usually here all day. Uh -huh. The assistant manager will come in in the morning, probably leave around 4 or 5. Yeah, that's too early. That's too early. I don't really do nothing early. I'm good. Like, I'm real. I just too early for me. So you can't come in that early? Like nah, that. nah, I'll be sleeping. I like to sleep. I feel you. Just a little. I feel you. I feel you. So, this, as I said, that may not be the right position for you. Right, right. I usually close up in the evening. Right, right. First thing, you should count the doors down and make sure that everything is done at the end of the night. And y'all not willing to negotiate and switch that around or nothing for nobody. Some of the days, it has to be. Right, right, right. Okay, okay. So, you know, I don't mind making it to where you have different shifts. Right. But you definitely, some of those things, it has to be open. You're not a morning person that will. So, so far, do it sound like I'm a good fit? 
for, for the. It's for, not. It's not about that. You're you're a bad fit. You're you're honest. You right. Listen, you're one of the first people that probably really walked through this door, and that spoke your mind honestly. You know what I'm saying? Right. People don't come in here and really say because exactly they say what, what they want to do to get the job, and then they go. show you. There you go. Yeah, that's why so I say because you're one of the first people that is rare to speak your mind and say, listen. Nah, that ain't gonna work. You know what? That's why I'm probably jobless. <laughs> nah, I don't think. Don't look at it like that, man. Don't, 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 mm -hmm. don't look at it like that. But you know what? Let me just tell you this right for future reference. You see how you just told me like, yo, you know, oh nah, you know the vibe or something. And I and I could respect that. I could take that and you know dumb it down and, and, and respect it with you. So now let me just give you a little jewel on that. The right. same way how you just told me that. You gotta apply that for yourself sometimes when you're dealing with other people as well because they might not be like me and could take how you talk or right, you right, 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 right. So it might kind of like spook them and make them look and be like, oh, no, I don't want this dude because you know when we're dealing with Caucasian skin color, mm -hmm. they look at us a little different. Yeah, they do. And you know they, yeah, you know what I'm saying? So we gotta know how to talk when we amongst them. Right, right, right. That's right. just what I'm saying. Like, I respect you because I understand I come from where you come from. Right, 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 right. I ain't from no rich person. You from Section family. 8, too? No, I ain't from no Section oh, 8. Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm from Section from 8. The, that's what I said. I'm just saying. I'm from, I'm from I don't the, know what's funny about that. I'm from the hood. It's just, yeah, that's what I said. She laughing about That's not funny. No, she's laughing because, listen, hold on, bro. Because you're taking offense to things. Okay? Yeah. You can't take offense to things when you're telling things. Right, right. When you're throwing um, it out there. Yeah. Things. We're not. Yeah. We're, we're the same. Right, right. You understand what I'm saying? Uh-huh. We all the same color. Y'all got DJ booth in here too. I can DJ too. So you could do that? Yeah, I'll do that. I'll put, put my phone up to the ox and switch, switch the song. Simple. Well, well DJing here is a little bit different. We're not really yeah, I know with the, the scratching and all that. Uh, yeah, I don't do all that. But what I'm saying is this, right? Other people, they might not be able to take you in right. certain ways. So this is probably why some things might be a little hard for you thoughts with others. Right. See, I understand and I can relate to you. Mm-hmm. You understand what I'm saying? So mm. that's that's what is different. Everybody oh. can't relate to everybody. Right. That's all. Like mm -hmm. you might can relate to this lady. Yeah. You might don't relate to this next lady. You might don't understand what she's saying. Like right. this, what you're talking about, I don't understand that. Exactly. That's all I'm saying. Mm -hmm. But you know, we're like, what, what, you got his numbers? Yeah, I'm, um, what is your availability? Uh, I mean, just night. I'm a night type of guy. That's what time I get out. So and that's, a, I, give us a, give us a, give us a specific time that, that you could come in and that you is willing to leave. Around like 6 p.m. All right, so 6 to like, yeah, what, six like 12? To, uh, 12 a little bit too late. I got stuff to do. Uh, I say like 10. So say six to ten. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just some, something simple. Something simple. Okay. That's all. I'm a simple guy. Okay. You know, and I got my baby mama number down. She don't pick up like or anything. Right. Give, give, put the number. Uh, four zero four. Ninety eight. Seven two. Nine nine. That's it. All right. So that's what you want to look. You, huh? I am. Yeah. This is just try. I'm four zero four. Nine eight seven. Yeah, two two. Nine nine. Another nine. Seven two nine nine. Three nine. Yeah, yeah, that's it. I got you. Okay. All right. And her name? Oh, who am I? I'm calling her phone for you. Yeah, call. Yeah, her name Tisha. Okay. Call her T. T. Yep. Okay. So we when we call that number right there, we can contact her. Uh huh. Yep, yep, yep. All right. Any, um, if you can leave, do you have any references that I can reach out to? Because I know you said you were a man. Uh, I don't really like people in my business. I don't give out references because y'all got to call them and then they going to know where I'm working. And you know what I'm saying? And, and I don't want nobody to know, oh, he work here and people judge me of where you. I'm working. I don't really I do you. all the reference stuff. And I got you. People be trying to judge a guy. You feel I me? Got you. I I'm got just you. here. Like I said, I'm trying to win. I watch Lil Baby and people got ice chains. I know you got a nice car, a nice house. I want that too. That's what I'm trying to get. What kind of car you drive? I have self car. Okay. Well, that's good. See? What kind of car you drive? I drive a regular Honda Sport. We got Honda. Uh, yeah. All of us have Honda. Where you live at? You live here. Uh, now nah, I'm like house. What's your address? You live in this area? My Listen to what you asking. Me. Okay, I'm sorry. Yeah, it's too personal. Yeah, like that's this is an interview. Yeah, interview. I'm sorry, and I'm asking. I'm getting out of hand. Yeah, it's all good. It's a mindset thing. I got you. I got you. But we definitely Do gonna you have give any you questions a... for us. No, nah, that's it. I mean, I'm cool. I mean, I if, I'm, if I'm a fit, I'm a fit. If I'm not, you know, I'm not. But I mean, it's only real. It take it take a team to make a team. No doubt, and that's the key word, right? Right. Teamwork. Well, we definitely gonna give you a call back, and I'll call her and. 
we'll let you know as what to look to put for these hours that you said that you eligible to work. Right, 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 right. All right, right, right. Okay, okay, I got you. Call you, man. All right, before I leave, can y'all give me a free meal or something? I'm hungry. A free meal? No, I'm just, I'm just a little hungry. I ain't ate nothing. I'm just. We don't give out free milk. Okay, I, it's cool. I, 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 I try to see, see what I. All right, just a little yeah, cup of water. That's it. All right. Got you, brother. All right, okay. All right. Hey, we was messing with you. She set you up to get. Right. <laughs> Cause he takes so much shit, yeah, like, like, all right. So, no, um, I had to sit in it because I, I was trying to fight somebody. No, but I wouldn't have did that. I was I'm waiting on you to ask for the light. He was gonna ask you for a lighter. <laughs> <laughs> he like, yo, I had a cigarette. Yo. I was supposed to have a phone call. And get on the phone. That's why I really. Yo, yo, but let me hold, yo, hold your phone for my baby mother. No, 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 no. You can't use her phone. For no, when you when you laughed at the section eight, he's like, hey, yo. He was like, that's what he really got mad when I start pressuring you. Know you. Why? He yeah. could take it, but he would take it to feed you. you so I'm like, yeah. Oh, we ain't even getting ready to do that. Like, it was funny. What's funny? <laughs> what you just said? You know what I'm saying? And I'm, I'm like, you know, I understand you. Somebody else might don't be able to understand. Yeah, yeah, but I'm saying, but what's she laughing at? <laughs> Yo, he tries to use my father like that motherfucker. Like, he's like, yo, so how much did you make? What <laughs> do you make? Like, what we want that 45000 he's talking about. Oh, yeah, I, I can change. work. That's a little change. <laughs> 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 hey, ain't it? I was like, bro, I really thought he was going to quit it a long time ago. I really thought. Yo. He, this was the most professional he's ever been. We yo. just knew he was going to go long. Yo. Oh, we just knew he was going to go Because he felt my background a little bit. Because right he felt my background a little bit. That's yeah, the only that's reason. Me, I, I, oh, he was feeling you. He was yeah, he like, he like, yo, he but he like, like, I'm like, no, nah, I understand that. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, I, I feel, <laughs> and what I'm saying is when he said everything we seen, what I'm saying to you though, I'm right. Really right. I know, that's what I feel. Every, every interview, right. they don't come in here and be like, right. I, that ain't for me. Right. <laughs> He's like, no, I never done that. <laughs> My baby, you were done. When he started talking about the big words and shit, can you, can you tell me what that means? He's like, yeah, he like, yo, yo, you use, yo, no, 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 no. Can you break every time I say something? 
Can you break that down for me? Cause I, I don't really understand that. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm like, you don't understand embrace. <laughs> Yo, what the, but I should have knew something because she's not even really asking the question that she normally would ask. Him. I'm like, oh, but then again, question. you could. She could have been scared. You handle it. There was just a lot of vibes, you know though. What? As I, was exactly, I can pick how your I read exactly people. I thought, like, yeah. I that she was like, oh, yeah. I I, know, like you know, she, she not with nervous. the shit. Yeah. She getting a little nervous. I gotta handle. I gotta yeah, that's how I was. I but I, I read him so well, like, he was like... I still see him recording, so I asked him, I said, what you think? Come on, it should be right there. <laughs> <laughs> he's yeah, a dog. I'm like, I'm like, he's a dog. And then with the number, when I didn't give all the numbers, he was like... I was like, hold on, this is... I'm like, yo, she's like, yo, um, what you think? What you mean, what you think? <laughs> this man just asked you, yo, can I get some free food? You think you want to hire somebody? Like, what are you talking about? He's a dog. <laughs> what does that mean? A dog, no good, no good. <laughs> What are you talking about? Bro, we just got out of Spice House. Me and my girl teamed up. We teamed up and we got my boy. Look at him, he on the phone going off. But y'all come up to Spice House, let's see how nice it is in Atlanta. Look up Spice House, get that, get that right there. But in that man, stay tuned, like, comment, subscribe. Let's get to it. Comment what job should we do next? We coming your way. You really, it's, it's really hard tonight. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm gonna I'm try to get I'm gonna try to get you through. Um, right. But you gonna definitely have to, you know, talk to a second manager. But you know. Right. So I just really want to know, uh, get to know you a little bit, know something about you. Uh, you play video games at all? You play? Yeah, I be playing the game, stuff like that. Yeah. What you, what you play, no man? I be playing uh, different stuff, Call of Duty. Call you know what I'm saying? Just a lot of other like stuff. Okay. Uh, 2K, 2K. Uh, that's a 2K10. Cause I don't really, that's the best one oh, that okay. I play. I don't really like the other one. So, so you like the older consoles more than? No, no, I got the PS4, but I play 2K10 oh. because I just, I like playing it because how it is. The shot and everything, the crossover. And my, my player, I got him up to like a thousand. So. All right, all right, cool. Right. Uh, um, how long you been working up here? Oh right, man, I've been in it for a little minute, man. Uh, I'm a I'm a huge gamer in real mm -hmm. life. You know what I mean. I actually used to work for EA Sports back in the day, man. That's cool. Uh, so Hard you, times, and then you ended up here. Yeah, man, I mean, you know, you 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 kind of grow and and you kind of develop, you know, other aspects. Mm -hmm. You know, I don't necessarily want to right. make games my whole life. Uh, you know what I mean. Uh, yeah, I'm like, okay, all right. All right. Uh, so outside of that, my man, uh, if you were to sell me uh, 2K10, how would you sell it to me? I ain't selling 2K10, so I couldn't sell it. Uh, all right. Uh, what about uh, 2K21? Right. I would be like, you, what you want? You know what I'm saying? Like, you gonna buy it or not? Because these games, it's a mindset thing. When you get it, it's just kind of like, if you wanted to not the upright of people, and this okay i i mean but but let's be real this this man you man let's be let's be real you know um you can't really just tell them like that you right, 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 right. Gotta, you know right well i yeah, yeah it's a cool game it's came out a lot of upgrades and blah blah, blah. And like you know just all that other crap you know and that's why it's just tell them like you want it you know what i'm saying yeah, yeah. but, but you can't say crap no nah, i wouldn't you know. say no nah, i wouldn't say that yeah, yeah. but it's crap you know that's between me and you <laughs> It's early, you know, it's early in the morning. Yeah, 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 I got you, I got you. you so when you get on. hired, like, do you get that? Uh, yeah, you get a, <laughs> you get an opportunity, you get a, a, a little step before everybody else, you know, mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. you come pre-order it, you know, right. you know. Yeah, you get a little opportunity, man. All right. Yeah, yeah, cool. All right. Um, so, uh, have you ever had any past experiences in retail, selling stuff at mm -hmm. all? Uh, it's really like when the PS5 come out, I was just like, you know, all the games is coming out on it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You pretty hyped on that PS5. Yeah, huh? hey. <laughs> for real. Hey, what did I get? What are games come out on there? Uh, uh, it's gonna be some. You, you should be telling me this, man. You, you should be telling me. You, you inform me on what you think coming. Right. Out. What I mean, just normal stuff. Basketball, yeah. football, shooting games. Yeah. There's a lot of other fun stuff. You know. Yeah. Just fun stuff. Fun it's, stuff. This is early. It's early in the morning. Okay. Uh, what was the question you asked? Uh, have you ever uh, 
done any retail experience? Do you have any experience selling mm. things? Uh, yeah, I used to sell shoes. Shoes, uh, okay. Okay. Facebook uh, market. I used to meet old people. Little shoes I used to want no more. I used to dump my hundred dollars, two dollars, two hundred. There's little stuff like that. People trying to lowball you and stuff like that, and they just try to like you know like please. Mm -hmm. And how did you overcome that when people tried to tell you, oh no, that's not worth two hundred? What? How did you overcome it? How did you sell it? Upsell uh, it? Ma, like you know. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> Uh, That's one way to go. Yeah. All right. But but in this situation, if somebody was trying to buy that PS Five, mm -hmm. um, how would you how would you go about like it? If somebody trying to buy it, like me, I'm trying to buy it because I'm trying to buy it. Or do y'all? <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. If you if you were to I buy, mean, it. <laughs> hey, I'm just being real. I mean, if I was trying to sell it, I'd just be like, hey, like this is the hottest thing out. People went crazy over it. Yeah, and like you want it, you feel me? Like I'm gonna just buy it. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna get it because I get what I want. Mm -hmm. Okay. Right. Um, this is early. Uh, okay. Um. So you say you get what you want, what you want. That means you're you're very motivated at at uh, achieving your goals exactly. at the highest points. Uh. So uh, what is the current goal for you right now? Oh. Uh, Really, just that PS5. I'm just trying to get that. Other than that, like, I got a lot of goals. Like, you know what I'm saying? My baby mama, take care of her, get her somewhere in a good ex establishment, like, establish, establish place. Establishment? Right. Okay. Because, like I said, there's just a lot of stuff going on. Okay. And just, like, a lot of, like, you know, a lot of different things be going on through the, through the city. Mm -hmm. You feel me? Yeah. And that's just what it is. Like, and that's just what it is. And I'll be off, be off a lot of, like, you know, you know. You know what I'm saying? It's just okay. off that, just just getting them off. Right now, that's all I'm selling. Oh. I'm just so, selling pills right now. So you're medi you, that's medicine for you? No, nah, these, these perks. Perks? Right. All right. Um. That cool? Well, you can't. I, I mean, mean, you can keep listen, it real listen, with me. You, I mean, keep it, listen. you keep it real with me. Am I being too rude? No, nah, listen, man. I'm I'm out front where you from too, man. I'm, right. I'm, I'm, I know all about all of that good stuff. Right, I know. But That's you know, this not this not my establishment. You know, I can't have you in here just you know doing whatever, selling the. You know, they have kids coming here all the time. No, I'm not selling stuff. to the customers. That's what I'm doing at the moment. That's what I'm. Oh. That's my clothes. That's why I'm high. I'm temporary. Got my job at. That's that's your job at the moment. Right. That's what I'm doing right now. So other than that, like I said, it's just like I said, I feel like the job would be a good fit for me because I understand I ain't then like, why do y'all cheat people out of the games? Why when people turn in the games and stuff like like that, like you know, like people y'all wanna cheat, like you take the with the prices. With right. That well that's not me, my man. I'm I'm gonna just keep it honest. That's not on But you me. work here, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it is you. No, but that's not my that's not like my policy. That's the GameStop that. policy. Right. So you But know. you work here though. You ain't trying to fix that. Like I'm gonna come here and try to change a lot of that stuff up. Uh I mean well you I mean if you work hard, you could possibly move up and then I work get hard. A chance what to you mean by that? Just I mean just saying um You say if I'm just saying because I work hard. Yeah, yeah. I mean this is a real easy job, like I said, my man. Um but you're gonna start at the bottom, so and able to get to that point where you changing, you know, you're gonna have to put in a lot of time. Okay. Uh, well, we open in like two minutes. Right. So, uh, so we're like, what's the next step? Like, are you gonna give a good word in or whatever? Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna give you. I'm gonna give a good word to. Uh, you got to go through a second uh interview with. Uh, you didn't ask me all the questions. Yeah. Well, we running out of time, my man. I gotta. I you gotta ask me one more question. Like, I got a good vibe with you, my man. Uh, you just ask me one more. Just one more. All those pages, and you ain't even ask me everything. Yeah, yeah, cause I, I, you know, like I said, my man, I got a vibe for you. I'm trying to get you. I'm trying to work with you, my man. I'm trying to just, you know, go ahead and get you to that next step, cause I want to prepare you. You know what I mean? We need. I came dressed up. Work. I came dressed yeah, up for this. That's I, I what I'm like, saying. I like right. So that's what I'm saying. I came dressed up for the job, and like I said, when the PS5 come out, I want to be here for that. You'll be here. You you might have to wait in line because it's I'm not, not really guaranteed. Only, I'm not waiting in line. Nope. It's not guaranteed that you will be able to. Thought. You didn't say nothing. But, uh. Yeah, my man, this was a good interview, man. Um, I, like I said, we'll give you a call back if you, uh. 
Excuse me. Call my rap. If you are, if I call my rap real fast. Excuse me. Yeah, I'm just gonna call my rap real fast. That's all I'm doing. I'm just trying okay. to say. Cause yeah. it's early. That's what I'm saying. Usually, I don't really. Yeah, yeah. You good? You good, my man? That's um, what I say. It's a good. I see. Like I say, I know y'all about to open. But other than that, you like it here and stuff like that. It's cool. Uh, yeah, it's cool, man. Like I say, man, I I love yo. doing this, man. Yo, yo, you gonna pick me up? <laughs> and what? All right, my man. Hey, we got to open up. Um, now I'm at the job interview right now. I'll see if you're going to come pick, pick me up. Hold on. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, my man. Where your car at? I'm about to go. Where your car? We got to Why are you looking like that, fool? Oh, I got to go get it. <laughs> you ain't going to get the car? I got to go get Yeah, I got to go get the car. It's my brother. You like my outfit? Yeah. Hey, my man. Uh, yeah, we about to open up, my man. Like I said, right, I'm gonna just sit right here. here. I'm gonna just sit right here. Uh, you could, you could chill. Like you could chill. We gonna, uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna move all this stuff. So right, I'm on the phone. That's what I'm saying. I understand that. I'm on the phone. Though. That's a ride, though. Yeah. So, so would you have uh, transportation coming to work and stuff? Wouldn't you take me to work? Oh, um, yeah, I got you, bro. Uh, it's gonna be every day. Yeah, every day. At five a.m. Of course. 4 30. Y'all don't even work. Y'all not even open at 5. Sometimes we come in stock early, and that's probably. Right. Okay, that makes sense. Well, we might have. have <laughs> you ain't even got a lot to just do, man. You don't know who this is? Uh -huh. You don't look familiar to you? Uh uh. <laughs> man, I'm pranking you. This is funny, Marco, dude. Mass. <laughs> oh, man. I'm calling you, man. You gonna do that dude on Walmart videos? Oh, <laughs> bro, man, I'm not even recognizing. You sitting there lying to me. I'm rude, though. I'm saying you come in with. You um, trying to keep it real or stuff? You want to give me get the job? I mean, yeah, you I want you to get the job, man. man. Cause, cause, listen, man, we gotta help each other out. This is time. It's bad times of pandemic. Bro. Right, right, right. You know, it ain't. But you didn't tell me when I put on my perch. You should have been like, come on. Like, uh, <laughs> you ain't got a lot of that, man. You wouldn't give him a job. Yeah, he wasn't gonna work. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you wasn't gonna hire me. You wasn't gonna hire me. I'm clean. <laughs> no, I had to tell you what with your boy. I appreciate it, though. I mean. And then you were gonna ask all the questions. Hey, I had to, I, I had to uh, skip a few of them around, but you know, uh, just by the way you came in dressed, man, I was like, uh, I don't know if you gonna. <laughs> right, right. You take it more serious. Yeah, you come to work like this every day. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah. Right. Okay. So he had put, he put the camera right there. Ah, uh, uh, GoPro, uh, bro. and then another one. Uh, damn. That's why you were sitting there. <laughs> So how you didn't see that shit either. Cause all these little games, you got shit, little toys in here. What up, man? Other than that, man, we just got GameStop with that, man. Subscribe, like, comment, tell us what, look, <laughs> look at this guy right here. <laughs> he wasn't gonna give me no job. Other than that, man, tell me where we should go next and apply. Like my boy got me the interview, he holding the camera. Thanks yes. to you, my guy. But other yes, than that, sir. I need another, I need to go to Chick-fil-A. But other than that, man, like, comment, subscribe. Let's get to it. Any reason why this is up, it's just giving me like jail bars. Yeah, it's, it's COVID and we wanna make sure that we can communicate. Yeah, I just don't really like jail bars and all that. Do you have to be here with me? Yes. I have to. Why? Because you got two families already. You yeah. want your third? Literally trying to extend some courtesy to you right now. Because I understand, I, you know, I come from where you come from. What you do, y'all? It's your boy, Funny Marco, and, and... It's your boy, DK. We here with my girl right now, so tell them what you got us doing today. We are about to prank our general sales manager, Rodney. That's right. And let them know where we at. We're in Atlanta, Georgia right now at the infinity. Of South Atlanta. Hey, and if they want to come get a car, what they got to do? They need to give us a call. You can call me directly, Keisha. I'm the internet manager, and we can be reached at 678-783-1194. So uh -huh. why, why do you feel like it's a good thing with us pranking him? Like, what's his temperature like? What's gonna get him, like, upset? Um, He's gonna be upset with the whole idea of being pranked because he thinks he's, like, super smart. Nobody can ever get him, so. Oh, man, other than that, I want y'all stay tuned. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe on both YouTube channels, DK, and make sure y'all come up here and shop, and let's get right to it. Get that infinity sign one time. Let's get it. The one o'clock interview is here from the community service program. Okay, cool. What's going on, man? How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? Uh, how you doing, doing sir? What's going on? Doing. Come on, grab a seat, man. How's your day going? Going pretty fine. Pretty good. 
good? Yeah. I had seen that y'all was hiring and that she had, you know, I know we conversated about getting a little job. I had just, you know, like. Yeah, I mean, we, we are, we're hiring and, and you know, mm -hmm. obviously, you know, being mm -hmm. as though we're on the side of town, we want to make sure we reach out to the community, make sure we can try to give guys a leg out, you know, especially coming in fresh out, I'm assuming. Mm -hmm. just, just came home? Yeah, just okay. like, what, three or four months ago? Five. Huh? Five, months. Five. Yeah. Okay, so, you know, I, we're going to start fresh. Obviously, you're here now, so we're going to try to do the best to, to mm -hmm. get you on the right foot, get you on the right direction. Mm -hmm. um, tell me tell me a little bit about yourself. Uh, well, I mean, I really just be, I, lo I be low-key. Like, you know, I really don't like going out in public eye. Like, just the situation that I got in, it was just real bad for me. Somebody had just, you know, told on me, you know. But before then, like I said, I used to just, like, work at McDonald's. I was a shift leader. But you know how that go. Like, you know, the Big Macs, they was going crazy. I uh, also worked at Popeye's. So I'm really, it's, I used to sell a lot of stuff. So that's why I feel like the car salesman <clears throat> would be good for me. Because it's just all about, it's really a mindset thing when it comes into sales. And like I said, these cars are just like a Big Mac, if you think about it. Because once they release, anything can happen. And, you know, it's a line of people going in and out. It's okay, so basically you feel like you're naturally a salesperson. Right, right, right. You right, communicate right. well with customers. And, right. and if you feel like if you have a good product, you'll be able to market it to the to the customer. Exactly, exactly. Effectively. Exactly. That's basically what you're saying, correct? Exactly. Okay, and you said your name is Jordan. Is that right? Yeah, well, you call me J-Dub, too. You want me to call you J-Dub? I mean, it don't really matter. I, I prefer to call you Jordan. Right. right. You know, this, this, I totally agree with you as far as the sales goes. As far you know, but this isn't McDonald's. You know, it's a luxury line. We're here to give customers excellent, you know, experience and customer service. And when we introduce ourselves, saying your name, Jordan, that's mm -hmm. perfectly fine. You know, Jay does. Hold on. Hold on. What's that? Do you, hold on. Hold on. Do you have to be here with me? Yes. I well, have to. Well, because you got two felonies already. Yeah. What's your third? No, I'm just asking because, like I said, I just don't. I really want the job. When I was saying, I didn't know that you had to come in here with right, me. Listen, lock in and do what you have to do. You think I want to be? I don't want to be here. Either. I know, but then you don't have to be in here with me. I have to. <clears throat> okay. Yeah. Sorry yeah. about. Sorry about. Good? That. Sorry about that. Yeah. No problem. No problem. This is my PO officer, and they like he got to go with me wherever I go and everything like that. No, nah, I, like, I totally understand. I totally understand. I just, you know, like I said. You know, I come from, you know, where you come from. I'm from Philly. You know, I got a lot of family and friends. I'm sorry, I just put these here to remind him so he won't act up. I'm sorry. No, nah, I get it. You know, but he, he's going to be fine. We're going to take care of him. Right. Like I said, I'm, I'm here. So to what are y'all requirements for the job? Like, what is the requirement? You got you to gotta be at work on time. You know, you got to make sure your attitude What's on time? Like 9 a.m. I'm just saying, like, I know, so not 9 on 1 or nothing like that? No. You know, being being on time is being late. You know, in real life, you know, we, we're, we're trying to. Can you run that past me again? I, you said being on time. Being on time is being late. You know, you want to make sure you're 10 or 15 minutes early. That way you can get everything situated, get your office situated. So that way when you get on the phone, then it's time to make, you know. So, like me, customers. what I bring to the table is honesty and respectable, respectable, respectability. Say that one more time. Respect, respectful respectfulness okay. right. and like I said kindness and like I said I just want to get out of this situation I need this job because they watch me if I don't get this job I'm going back I ain't trying to go back and you know what I'm saying as a black man to another black man you should understand where I'm coming from and like I said I like I said I used to do drugs back in the day but uh -huh. I stopped doing drugs mm -hmm. and then like I said they test me every day well that's good I mean I'm here to support you you know, like I said, my, my background. Any reason why this you know, is up, it's just giving me like jail bars. Yeah, it's, it's COVID, and we want to make sure that we can communicate. Yeah, I just don't really without, like jail you know, bars and all this that. Is you won't really have jail oh, bars. Yeah, you... Hey. Hey. Just want to see how things were going. It's good. Can I just talk to you just for a minute? Gentlemen, you mind if I get just one minute with Keisha? Just we got to leave? Yeah, just a just couple minutes. That's awesome. I know, that's what I'm saying. So, the interview just started. Are we coming back in here? It's just a moment. I just want to make sure. I got a couple other appointments for the day. I just want to make sure we're, you know, being respectful of time as well. All right. Just a few minutes, though. Thank you. Hit the black button. Yeah, there you go. Yeah.
We just started it. No, no, no. I, I got you. And cool. we'll, we'll finish it up. Um, I just need to talk to my I sister. appreciate everything you're doing. Hey, home. Just, I you know, bear with them. For sure. Come on. Hey, so what's going on? Keisha. Listen, we here to, you know, do the outreach program. But this, look at this dude got stains all over the shirt. Look like he got on. I don't even know. They look like scrubs. I think you got the Yeezy slides on. I mean, I don't really know. This is not going to work, you know. But just going forward, first of all, how did you even come in contact with this guy individually? Well, I know his mom, and I kind of told her that we would help him. And this is an opportunity for us to do something with him. So I figured this would be a great fit for him. He told me to call him Day Dub, Keith. He's, a, he's back in the door. Could you just let me? I'm gonna oh. wrap it up. Thank you though, but let's just let's vet these a little bit. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Thank yeah. you, Keisha. I appreciate it. Come yeah, on, just come on in. Up. Yep. Come on in. Yep. Mm -hmm. Thank you though. Okay. We'll finish up. So let me ask you, man. Did, did you have a different shirt you could have put on? So you got stains all on your shirt. At the end of the day, I know you just came home, and I'm I'm here to support you. And why are you, you being so rude? No, I'm not being rude, sir. I'm really not. I'm actually being professional. And going forward, if we were to extend this employment to you, I want to make sure that you can come to work looking professional, you know, and I can right. help you. I would extend that to you. I got a shirt, you know, we may not wear the same size, but I will help you. I just want to make sure your mindset is right and your attitude is right going forward. And you know that you're supposed to be, you know, if, if you have the ability to be a little more professional, I'd appreciate it. Can you give me a second, please? Hold on. Yeah. Why do you smell like weed? Why do you smell like marijuana? Hmm? You gonna really do that? Why you I'm sorry, just continue. I'm so, like, so basically, like I said, I, I understand. Like I said, it's a, a good environment, and like I said, I can see myself fitting here. And like I said, Where I want to. Where do you see yourself in five years? What What do you see for your life going forward? Now that you're home and everything that you, you you got a fresh, clean slate. Where do you see yourself in five years? I mean, you know, obviously getting to it, getting to the bag. You know, I mean, on Instagram, you know, I mean, I see a lot of people on Instagram doing their thing. And, like, I just want to be one of them. I want money just like they want money. And, like I said, like, where I'm at right now in, in life, it's it's a, it's a, a, a torpedo. It's a what? It's like a like a tornado. Like, it's like it's just going, okay. you know. And, like I said, I'm going to be real with you. Yeah, please. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I, like... Like I said, even if I be a porter and wash cars, it don't even matter. Like, you know what I'm saying? I could be in the back. I ain't got to be in the front. I see you look real nice. Where you come from? Like, I know you had to work up from your ground up. Like, That's a fact. Right. So you got to, like, you can't judge me off of how I come in here in the office. And like I said, like you said, it's a mindset thing. No. And, and just so we're clear, I'm not judging you. I just want to let you know that, you know, when you come here to work, you know, if you're a porter, if you're looking for a porter's job, I can definitely so do bring let, to those people. Do y'all let anybody know? This is the sales. This is the sales. Right, right, I understand. Yeah, so we so want to like, make sure we have well, professionalism when right. dealing with it. So am I finding out if I get the job today? Um, I got to talk to Keisha about some things. You know, we got to review some information, you know. Um, and you didn't we'll, even ask me on interview questions, like about what? No, I did. I, I asked you, you know, where do you see yourself in five years? That's important because, you know, in order for you to get somewhere, you have to have a plan. For I'm, getting, I'm getting to it in five years. And that's what I'm saying. Even with the whole the whole set the whole setup, like I just feel like it's all like she coming here while we interviewing. Like we ain't even got into the questions. And then like I said, I don't know if you're judging me because this is like you know my pro officer got to be with me. I don't know why he in the interview with me. It's unprofessional. I understand that. Mm -hmm. And like I said, I got I got to get gas money. I had to I got to I had to get gas to get up here. I had to ride the bus. So, and then y'all yeah, talking about coming back. Let me ask you. Let me ask you. If I were to give you a job today, right? why if? Can I finish, sir? Please. Why? Because I'm trying. I'm I'm literally trying to extend some courtesy to you right now because I understand. I you know I come from where you come from. I got families in jail. Mm -hmm. Hold on. What I'm saying is, I feel like I'm I'm talented enough to train anyone to be able to be successful as long as their mindset is open to learning new things, right? right? If I were, you mentioned gas money, you mentioned a bus, right? If you get into work, that's your responsibility. So with the cars. Oh, hold on, let me finish what I'm saying, sir. You get into work, that's your responsibility. If I were to say, you know what, I'll pay, I'll get you, I will go to the store. If I were to hire you 
and I could get you some shirts and I can get you some clothes That's just awesome. to be able to come to work, right? Would, can you commit to being on time every day and having your attitude straight and being coachable? Are you a coachable individual? Because as far as your outfit and stuff like that, that's no big deal. I can help you with that. But I need someone that's here that's going to be willing to learn and willing to take the steps to get to the next level in their life. Are you willing to do those things? Yeah. And I see I got a lot of cars. Are you? Are we willing to use one of these cars to get back and forth? Like, no, absolutely not. So could you just get, like, all the, it's a lot of cars. Could you use them just for after the 60 days? Absolutely not. Those cars are for test driving customers that have potentially planned And then that's how I can test drive them and give you our review. No, absolutely not. Absolutely not. You get into work is your responsibility. Like I said, I can meet you halfway. Are you willing to have an open mind and come in with the right attitude going forward? From there, the sky's the limit, but you gotta have your mindset in the right place before I would take that step for you. Uh, can you step out real fast? This is the third time you told me to step out. Listen, this interview is not going good. He's not going to hire you. I'm I'm sitting here the whole time trying to really help you out, and you just keep messing up. You ain't even saying nothing to help me out. Oh, my God. This is crazy, man. I'm just putting these right here to remind you that it's not a game, man. You know what I'm saying? We let you out to have an interview. And you over here BS. What's wrong with you, man? Come on. I'm not. I'm lock saying, in, talking lock to him. I'm trying to just, get. I am like that. Just lock in, man. You're my Are favorite you guy. Are you still incarcerated? Is this a work release program? I mean, I don't know what they want to call it. So, like I said, I just need a job, and that's what I'm saying. I know it's a good fit, and I appreciate you for even, you know, acknowledging me about the stuff that you're acknowledging me about. But, like I said, my cousin, he need a rental. Do y'all do rentals or anything like that? No. No. Um, well, Jim, so I'm just saying, hold on, if you, hold on one moment. Just, one just moment. give him another chance. Just give him, I'm ask him a few more questions, you know what I'm saying? He, it might just, you know, something might click. He's a good kid. You know what I'm saying? You're on the phone in the middle Yo. Of the Yo. Yeah, I'm up here right now. <laughs> they, letting you go, they letting you get the car? No, I'm talking to him right now. I'm trying to figure out. It's my ride. Oh, uh, yeah. We need, we need that rental. All right. I'm about, to, I'm about to figure out. I don't know. I'm about to figure out, but it's probably going to be. I just need you to come pick me back up. How much gas do you need? Uh, you good. I don't need that. You sure? Just try to uh, finesse and get that rental, though. You st I'm still in the interview right now. Yeah, we, I'm trying to, uh, right, uh, just, I, no, no, but I'm just saying, I, like, no, really, this, like, on acknowledgement, like I said, if you, any advice that you can help me out with. Listen, you said you're ready, bro. This is what I, this, I give you some Hold advice. Can this, I talk this, to I give you some advice, man. You know, if you work hard and you have the right mindset, the sky's the limit. You know, this may not be the opportunity for you. I would love to give you a shot. Maybe I can put you in contact with our, our detail department manager. And see if he's looking for somebody. I do a lot of detailing. Yeah, like, you know, in my cell, in my cell, I used to decorate a lot, hang up pictures, and I had, like, you, you know, my. Decorate yourself? Huh? You used to decorate yourself? Yeah. Okay, that sounds like. Right, what do you think? Like, like. Quality, like man. And that, that's what I'm saying. I'm just really, like, I'm in a dark place right now. And I just, I'm just want to hit the light switch. Well, you need to, you know. Whoever you believe in, man, I think you need to get involved in that book, you know what I'm saying, and, and start to turn the pages, and, and maybe he'll be able to give you a better answer. As far it's as hard this, for me. I think it's. I think we've come to a conclusion here. It's, it's I, understandable. I, I appreciate you coming in, though, definitely, you know, and I wish you the best, you know, and I'll talk to my service manager. I'll talk to my detail manager. See so can we can we get some water or something? I didn't get no off oh, yeah, of the you water. Know I, can, I can definitely get you a water. I appreciate I got, you for giving him a chance, man. Right. Here you go, bro. Can he walk us out? I'm just saying, can he walk out with us? Nah, that's cool. Don't get up. Yeah. I know, I'll but that's what I'm saying. I know, but as I said, this. Let me hit the button. So, y'all really don't think I'm a good kid? Yeah. 